Tomorrow is Christmas Day. You will need to do your best in training. It decides the qu- Hey, don't tell me you've forgotten already. How could you forget? Director Herzog said that whoever performs best today can leave this place and go to the capital to study. So you have to try your best. We promised we would- This is the card I made. You just need to sign it with your name. Your clothes are on that chair. Come out once you've changed. Zed should be waiting outside. My little Renata, you're looking so pretty today. What are you doing? Why isn't Zee with you? What happened to him? Dr. Herzog, I'm just looking for some nice flowers that I can give you as a Christmas gift. The flowering season of the Arctic Rose has already passed. However, you have always found favor with Lady Luck. Keep looking, but remember not to neglect your training. One. If Director Herzog found out that Zed isn't up yet, he'd be in trouble again. I told him to get up. Why isn't he here yet? Oh well, I guess I'll have to wait for him a while longer. Has the time come once again to go and beg for scraps like a hungry stray dog? Why don't you leave that to Anton? What an obedient child. I approve. But today's training will determine who gets to go to the capital. Very easy. If I wanted to leave the orphanage, nobody could stop me from doing so. Well... Okay. I trust you. That's more like it. <sighs> I'll go back and take a nap. I will trust you with the Christmas gift box. Come and check it. Seems the supply ship hasn't arrived. Normally, the supply ship arrives just before Christmas. There'll be supplies for the whole year, and Christmas gifts. Ah, the training's about to begin. I must go now. Don't forget to find a date for tomorrow's Christmas banquet.
Renata, do you really mean it? I'm sorry. What a spoiled kid. Never learned to say I'm sorry, have you? I don't think you can ever go to the capital for the rest of your lives. Anton, forget it. These people are dummies. Go now, Mr. Herzog awaits. Why are there only two of you? Where is Z? Director Herzog, Z isn't- Huh? But yesterday he was just fine. Has something gone wrong with his dosage? Don't worry, he's going to be just fine. Look, we've made this Christmas card for you. My little Renata, aren't you the most heartwarming flower in this frozen land? All right, here is the training gear for today. Don't move a muscle until I give my orders. Anton, it's your turn. What a shame. So much time for such a simple test. Finally, a breakthrough. Out of the way. Send him back. Renata, are you all right? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Oh, good to hear. You are all my most precious treasures. So be careful. What happened to Anton? Just... Oh, Anton? Such great power. Surely it can only be a gift from the gods. Dr. Herzog, I'm sure you know who sent me here. If you are not willing to share with us the results of your research, we will halt all funding to your orphanage with immediate effect. So, the day has finally come. My warmest welcome, Commissioner Bond.
and chocolate for the kids. And my vodka, of course. It is only you this year. So I guess you must be carrying a whole year's worth of supplies for Black Swan Bay in your magic pocket. Don't worry, Doctor. That's why I called in a chopper, to get the essential supplies to you. Christmas gifts for the kids and vodka for you. I was given explicit orders to do so. How very touching. But did they really just send a young lad such as you here? This is highly unusual. Well, since you've figured it out, I'll be direct. There are changes taking place at headquarters. My superior is responsible for this harbor, but no one will tell him what the purpose of this place is. That's why I was sent here. My superior is convinced that this mysterious harbor, which costs a huge amount of money each year, must serve an incredible purpose. <laughs> oh. Oh, people in the Secret Service always overthink things and worry too much, Commissioner Bondarev. The assumption you make is totally unfounded. There is no unspeakable project being conducted here. My work in here is to build the largest genome bank in the world. Look at this place. A natural and totally self-sufficient cold repository. These samples can last hundreds of thousands of years without a power supply. Oh, a genome bank, huh? Ha! <laughs> Who are these kids, then? I took into my care these orphans with genetic defects while I was traveling around the country collecting gene samples. They are both my research subjects and my children. Please, allow me to finish their training first. We can have a good chat after that. All right, that's all for today. And don't forget to find a date for the Christmas banquet later. Thank you, Doctor. I've already found a date. Let me guess. Hmm. It's Z, isn't it? Go prepare the Christmas banquet. I have something important to discuss with the Commissioner. By the way, you were excellent during the training today. Here is your prize. Chocolate straight from the capital. Like it? It was supposed to be a Christmas gift, so don't tell anyone else. What do you think it's like on the other side of the ocean? The people on the other side of the ocean are probably wondering the same thing. Do you remember when you first saw it? You said that you wanted to be just like it, to be able to swim freely in the ocean. If that day ever comes, I hope that I'll be standing right next to you. I'm very happy to have you by my side. Right. Let's go back. 